business max today topic is lesson number 3 integral calculus 2 area of the region bounded by the curve is today topic we can evaluate the area bounded by the curve with the coordinate axis coordinate axis means x axis and y axis x axis and the y axis we can also calculate the area bounded by the curves bounded by the curves there are two types <coughs> four subdivisions two types one is area of the region bounded by the curve bounded by the curve y is equal to f of x y is equal to f of x x o x s y o y s this is x axis y o y s is y axis these two are coordinate axis coordinate axis the curve a straight line this is f of x this is f of x x equal to one straight line x equal to another straight line the area is the area is y is equal to this is f of x model area capital e is equal to integral the lower limit is a upper limit is b a to b y dx formula y dx the area of the region above x axis the area of the region above x axis given then area is integral a to b lower limit to upper limit y dx this is case number 1 subdivision number 2 x o x s y o y s these two are coordinate axes suppose the area of the region is below x axis the area of the region is below x axis lower limit is a upper limit is b this is y is equal to f of x y is equal to f of x the area of the region below x axis below x axis area is equal to or area of the bounded region is equal to integral lower limit a to b minus y dx the area of the region bounded by the curve y is equal to f of x above x axis area is a to b lower limit to upper limit y dx below x axis minus y dx lower limit a to upper limit b area of the region bounded by the curve area of the region bounded by the curve y is equal to no here x is equal to f of y first two cases y is equal to f of x next two x is equal to f of y take coordinate axis x o x s y o y s area of the region right hand side of y axis 
area of the region right hand side of y axis this is x is equal to f of y a curve area of the region right hand side of y axis so area is equal to here a is lower limit upper limit is b then a to b x dy area is x dy lower limit to upper limit next time Subdivision number two. X O X S Y O Y S are the coordinate axes. The curve is Y is equal to. In this case, x is equal to f of x. This is curve. Equation of the curve is x equal to f of x. f of y. Area of the region bounded by the curve is this is this area is left hand side of y axis. This is y axis, left hand side of y axis. Left hand side of y axis. Then area is equal to lower limit A, upper limit B. Then A to B, X minus X, minus X dy. In this case, minus X dy. These four cases we call as area of the region. Bounded by the curve. First two area of the region bounded by the curve. Y is equal to f of x. Next x is equal to f of y. First two area of the region above x axis. Above x axis. This place, this place, this place. This place. X number three point one. Sum number one. Using integration. Using integration, find the area of the region by the line two x plus y two y plus x is equal to eight. The x axis. And then line x is equal to two and x is equal to four. Let two y plus x is equal to eight is given equation. Now two y is equal to eight minus x. Y is equal to eight minus x divided by two. First, draw a straight line. We have to take the text in O Y. Draw a straight line. We have to take two points. Y is equal to eight minus x divided by two is constant. Now, x is equal to zero. Y is equal to four. x is equal to zero, y is equal to four. Next, x is equal to eight apply, y is equal to zero. X is equal to eight apply, y is equal to zero. And also here eight is zero. Therefore, one, two, three, four. Side eight one zero four next eight zero is on the x axis x 
एक्सट्रा से ओई ओई डैश जॉइन सिर्फ वो एक सिरो ठीक है डस्ट स्ट्रेट लाइन डस्ट स्ट्रेट लाइन इस कोई सीक्वल दे हम एक में से एक सिडर बाई टू नाउ टू लाइन सर की मन एक से सीक्वल टू और एक से सीक्वल टू है फोर एक से सीक्वल टू इस इसे एक से सीक्वल टू इसे एक से सीक्वल टू फोर एक से सीक्वल टू x is equal to 4. Now, the area bounded by the region is this area. The straight line below. In between, x is equal to 1 and x is equal to 4. The area of the shaded region is equal to integral 2 to 4. Area of the shadow region is above x axis. Therefore, for now y dx. Y e dx. Is equal to 2 to 4. Y is 8 minus x divided by 2. 1 by 2 is integral 0, 2 to 4. 8 minus x into dx into dx is equal to 1 by 2 2 to 4 8 dx minus integral 1 by 2 2 to 4 x in dx is equal to these two are cancelled. 4 integral 2 to 4 dx minus 1 by 2 2 to 4 x dx is equal to 4 x minus 1 by 2 into x square divided by 2. Taken over the limit 2 to 4 here 2 to 4 is equal to 4 in 4 minus 2 minus 1 by 4 16 minus 4 is equal to 4 into 2 minus 1 by 4 12 is equal to 8 minus 3 is equal to 5 square units Hence, area of the region is equal to. Hence, area of the region is equal to pi square units. Next, sum number 2. Find the area. Bound by the lines y minus 2x in minus 4 is equal to 0 y is equal to 1 y is equal to 3 and the y axis let him y is equal to y minus 2x minus 4 is equal to 0 is a straight line. Here y is equal to 2x plus 4. Now first table. x y a. x is equal to 0 applying 4 
x is equal to minus 2 applying 0. 0 for next time minus 2 0. Minus 2 0. Here 0 for a minus 2 comma 0. So next two lines are given y is equal to 1 and y is equal to 3. y is equal to 1. y is equal to 1. y is equal to 1 and y is equal to 3. Parallel to the x axis. Area of the region bounded by the curve x equal to f of y. Okay. Now area is equal to lower limit is 1, upper limit is 3, 1 to 3. <coughs> right hand side area of the region is minus 60 y. Left hand side is no. right hand side is 60 y, left hand side is minus 60 y. So minus x into dy. Equal to minus x 1 to 3 this is equal to y minus 4 x is equal to y minus 4 divided by 2 divided by 2 into dx is equal to 1 by 2 integral 1 to 3 negative sign inside the bracket we get 4 minus y into dy 4y minus y square divided by 2 taken over the limit 1 to 2 into 1 by 2 into first applying upper limit 4 3 is 12 minus 4 minus 9 by 2 minus 1 by 2 is equal to 1 by 2 8 minus 8 by 2 8 by 2 is 4 equal to 1 by 2 8 minus 4 is equal to 1 by 2 into 4 is equal to 2 third units hence area of the shadow region equal to 2 square units next the area bounded by the bounded by the parabola bounded by the parabola y square is equal to 4ax and its latter sector and its and its latter sector let him the equation of the parabola be y square is equal to 4ax <coughs> now right word parabola open curve is open right word parabola shape of the parabola is open right word therefore
Now lattice spectrum is given. So lattice spectrum in this case A. A comma zero is a point on the x-axis. A zero comma zero. Y square is equal to four A X. Now <coughs> lattice spectrum between the curves. Area is equal. Area of the side of the region. Area is equal to zero to a. Zero is lower limit. A is upper limit. The curve is open rightward. Take two part. One is above x-axis. Another one is below x-axis. These two areas are equal. Therefore, twice into above x axis y dx power okay dx now 2 into 0 dx from the given equation parabola equation o is take root on both sides root of 4 a x a is equal to 2 into root a into root x so y is 2 into root a into root x dx now 4 root a is constant 4 into root a c root a root x dx a. 1 by 2 c root a dx sequence term 4 into root a yeah, using the formula x power n dx is x power n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 x power n dx is x power n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 plus c ok now x power n plus 1 1 by 2 plus 1 is 3 by 2 divided by 3 by 2 take note limit 0 to a is equal to m 4 into root a reciprocal gives into 2 by 3 x power 3 by 2 0 to a this means 4 to sorry a by 3 root a into apply upper limit a to the power of 3 by 2 minus a is equal to 8 by 3 a to the power of 1 by 2 root a means a to the power of 1 by 2 into a to the power of 3 by 2 is equal to m 8 by 3 a to the power of 4 by 2 is 2 a square square given is area of the shadow region of the parabola is yes. 8 by 3 a square square units find the area then find the area bounded by the line y is equal to x the x axis and then x equal to and the coordinate means coordinate axis x is equal to 1 and x is equal to 4 let y is equal to x is straight line First x y e. x equal to zero y is equal to zero x equal to one name y is equal to one name x equal to two 
y is equal to 2 given x is equal to 1 x is equal to 2 now 2 2 then 3 3 and so on One one two two y is equal to x is a straight line. The point x equal one the line x equal one and x equal two x equal one is x equal to is x equal to 1 straight line x is equal to 2 straight line in between them is saddle region now area of the saddle region is equal to in integral the saddle region is y above x axis therefore y dx formula take note limit 1 to 2 1 to 2 1 to 2 y is x x dx integrating x we get x square divided by 2 Take note limit 1 to 2. It's equal to 1 by 2 is a constant number. <coughs> x square 1 to 2. Apply upper limit 2 square is 4. Minus lower limit 1 square is 1. So 3 by 2. 3 by 2 is equal to 1.5 square units. Area of the saddle region is one point five square units. Find the area of the region. Find the area of the region bounded by the line y minus 1 is equal to x, comma, the x axis and the ordinates. The ordinates. Ordinates means a point. Ordinates x equal to minus two and x equal to positive three. Let y minus one is equal to x is two. This is equation of the straight line. Y is equal to x plus one. table x y apply x equal to 0 1 so 0 1 apply x equal to minus 1 y is 0 apply x equal to 2 y is equal to 3 apply x equal to 1 y is equal to 2 Now, for the coordinate axis, 
next uh, minus 1 0 and next uh, 1 2 0, 1, next 1, 2, next minus 1, 0. Now, x is equal to minus 2 is given. x is equal to minus 2 straight line. The straight line passing through x is equal to minus 2. x equal to minus 2 straight line. Next, x is equal to 3 straight line. x equal to 2 to 1 below x axis. So, minus y dx power bar. Minus 1 to 3 above x axis. So, positive y dx power bar. Area, area of the shared region is equal to integral minus 2 to minus 1 minus y dx plus integral minus 1 to 3 above x axis therefore y dx power the property of integral minus a to b integral y dx is b to a y dx therefore 1 to 2 minus 1 to minus 2 y dx <coughs> plus integral minus 1 to 3 y dx but y is x plus 1 is equal to minus 1 to minus 2 x plus 1 dx plus minus 1 to 3 x plus 1 into dx integrating x squared by 2 plus x taken over the limit minus 1 to minus 2 plus integrating x plus 1 we have x squared plus a x x squared by 2 plus x a taken over limit minus 1 to positive 3 is equal to applying upper limit 4 by 2 plus so minus minus 2 minus lower limit 1 by 2 minus 1 by 2 apply upper upper limit ok lower limit bracket minus 1 square is positive 1 1 by 2 plus 9 by 2 plus 3 minus 1 by 2 minus 1 is equal to 2 minus 2 0 minus 1 by 2 plus 1 so half minus 1 by 2 minus of minus positive plus 1 half 
plus 9 by 2 plus 3 minus of plus 1 is of is equal to 9 by 2 plus a of plus of a 1 4 is equal to 9 by 2 plus 8 taking LCM plus 8 is equal to 17 divided by 2 square units the area of them share the region is equal to 17 by 2 square units find the area of the region find the area of the region lying in the first quadrant lying in the first quadrant bounded by the region y is equal to 4 x square x equal to 0, y is equal to 0, and uh, y is equal to 4. y is equal to 4x square. This is open upward parabola. This is first, this is of the form y x square is equal to 4 a y. Therefore, this is open upward parabola the shape of the parabola is in this case x square is equal to y divided by 4 this is of the form x square is equal to 4 a y this is of the form x square is equal to 4a y therefore open upward from now the shape of the open upward parabola is equal to 4 is given like next in quadrant is this this is first quadrant this is second quadrant this is third quadrant this is fourth quadrant so the area of the region bounded by lying in the first quadrant so this is area how to find the area area of the third region is equal to right hand side of y axis right hand side of y axis formula x dy here 0 comma 0 here 0 comma 4 so lower limit is 0 upper limit is 4 x dy is equal to integral 0 to 4 x take root on both sides we get x is equal to root y divided by 2 this is x apply x root y divided by 2 into <coughs> dy 
is equal to 1 by 2 0 to 4 y power 1 by 2 into a dy is equal to 1 by 2 y power 1 by 2 formula x2 power of n dx is equal to x2 power of n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 plus c in this case limit is given therefore c is not necessary therefore y power 3 by 2 divided by 3 by 2 taken over the limit is 0 to 4 so 1 by 2 into 2 by 3 taken over the limit in y power 3 by 2 0 to 4 2 to cancel 1 by 3 into y power 3 by 2 0 to 4 apply upper limit in 4 to the power of 3 by 2 minus 0 is equal to 1 by 3 4 by power 3 by 2 means say 4 power 1 into 4 power half this means 1 by 3 4 power 1 means 4 4 power half means say root 4 root 4 is equal to 2 into 2 is equal to 8 by 3 square units hence the area of the region is equal to 8 by 3 square units next some of us bound find the area bounded by the curve y is equal to x square and the line y is equal to 4 y is equal to x square and y is equal to this is a curve this is a straight line ok let the equation of the curve this is a parabola let the equation of the parabola b y is equal to x square <coughs> this is y is equal to x square is given therefore the curve is symmetric about a y axis the curve is as to the curve is open upward parabola curve is symmetric about y axis symmetric about a y axis draw the coordinate axis we will say 1 2 3 4 the open right word open upward parabola is y y is equal to four is parallel to what axis x axis. is equal to 4 straight line the curve is symmetric about y axis therefore both sides so the region
this is not necessary the area of the boundary region is below y is equal to 4 is equal to m <coughs> double sided phi is into 0 to 4 here, here 0 comma 4 maximum phi the curve is open upward in x dy equal to m rise into 0 to 4 from the curve into d y is equal to m 2 into y power 3 by 2 divided by 3 by 2 0 to 4 is equal to m taking reciprocal 4 by 3 4 no, y power 3 by 2 taken over limit is 0 to 4, 4 by 3 mm, 4 power 3 by 2 minus 0 is equal to 4 by 3 into 4 into 4 power half is equal to 4 by 3 into 4 into 2 is equal to m sixteen two sir thirty two divided by three square units and the area then hence the area of the shaded region shaded region is 32 divided by 3 square units number one find area the boundary region find the area of the region bounded by bounded by the line x minus y is equal to 1 and then subdivision number 1 x axis x equal to 2 and then x equal to 4 Number two, x axis, x equal to minus two, and then uh, x equal to zero. Question number two, find the area of the region, find the area of the region bounded by the line. x minus 2y minus 12 is equal to 0 and then number 1 y axis y is equal to 2 and then y is equal to 5 number 2 y axis y is equal to minus 1 y is equal to minus 3 these are the homework problems any doubt reply the message study well the homework do the 4 homeworks 1 2 3 4 there are 2 problems 4 submissions are there the homework submission is on time you uh, you get the attendance otherwise attendance absent therefore you have to
see the homework time is very very important homework submission is very very important so any doubt reply the message thank you